What's going on, YouTube? It is your boy, Jonathan Elijah from the Night Black Shack, and today I want to talk about the shift in content that I'm going to be having on this channel. Um, nothing negative. I, if anything, think it's probably one of the most positive things happening in my life, but I have been on my walk with God for a while now, and I am just really trying to find my gift, uh, find my purpose, and just inspire others in any way that I can. And so what that looks like as far as just shifting content for my channel is like, I don't want it to just be about the materialistic aspect anymore. I don't want it to be just about the vehicle that I have, the car that I drive. Yes, I enjoy it. Yes, it's not leaving the channel. I'm still going to be doing those things, but I don't want that to be the driving force anymore. I think for a while I was so focused on seeing all these big YouTubers like Quan, it's just a six. Um, let me think, who's another YouTuber that I watch? I mean, those are the main two that I watch in the car community that are pretty heavy. Uh, Matt Armstrong in the UK. It's like, I got so enveloped in wanting to be like them and where they are that I was missing out on, you know, making my own path. And so that's really what I want to focus on doing this time around. I want to just, just do more of me. I don't know how else to explain it. Like, I just want to put more of me into it. My walk with God at 22 years old. The fact that I still have a corporate job right now I'm recording this clip because last time I was talking and you couldn't hear my sound because my mic wasn't connected. But anyway, I am here again just letting you all know that there is going to be a shift in my content. I have been on my walk with God, as I stated in the previous clip. I went to church for the first time in a while on Sunday, but before that, uh, my girlfriend and I actually started a 365 day Bible reading plan. And in reading that Bible and just getting closer to God and um, even going to church this past Sunday, I have just been convicted of a lot of different things. And I have felt a shift in my life overall. And I just want to live my life for God fully. And I don't want to be one foot in, one foot out anymore. And so in that, I think that's also going to result in me just changing my content because whether or not I knew it, I'm starting to realize that even the content I was making before, not that I wasn't enjoying it, but I was always so focused on how many views I was getting, how many people were going to subscribe, how many people were watching my video instead of being focused on the fact that the people that are watching, you're inspiring, you're changing something, you're showing them something, they're enjoying watching you, you are being an inspiration to those people and not so worried about people who aren't watching you, like me, to be like Jonathan in the way that God has created me to be. And so in that, I want to shift my content to just be more intentional, um, more moving for people and just let you in more into my life, whether that be about how I'm feeling on a day to day basis in my corporate life or how it is now that I am living with my girlfriend. And this is my first apartment by myself, um, paying bills, just managing money, figuring out just the everyday is ins and out of life that you don't talk about or think about at 22 years old. Your 20s, I've heard my time and time again, and it's true are one of the most pivotal years of your life. Um, and so I don't want to spend it trying to chase a number. You know what I mean? Like if the number comes great, cool. If it doesn't, okay. But at least I impacted somebody and at least I made a change in at least one person's life. So I just want to make that shift. Um, I don't want to ramble and talk in circles, but God just put it on my heart to come here and make this video for you guys today and just let you know that I'm changing. Um, the content will change with me. It doesn't mean that this isn't a car channel anymore. It just means that it's not only a car channel anymore. Um, the logo won't change because I won't forget where I started and where the inspiration came from. Yes, I'm going to still be doing stuff for my car, but that doesn't mean I'll be just driven by my car. It's just a part of things that I like to do, but at the end of the day, it's a material aspect and there will always be another car. There will always be another part for a car. It'll just be always another one of that, but there can never be another one of me. So I don't want to miss the authentic aspects of myself by trying to only film my car or only recreate what I've seen done. Like I want to start creating my own. And so in that, we're just going to see where it takes me. I don't exactly know what everything looks like. But again, even this video, I didn't know until today for real that I was going to make this video and it was led honestly by God. So I'm truly letting him guide my steps now. Um, it doesn't mean that I'm going to come on here and preach to you all like you're in church every Sunday, but I am going to incorporate him more and more in my content and just be doing it for him through him. And hopefully 
I'll be able to continue to find my purpose and my gift in this life and just figure out what I'm meant to do in this world for other people. And as I'm doing things more and more, I feel like it is to inspire and just show what can be done. So, um, yeah, I just want you guys to be able to come on this journey with me. Um, I'm enjoying it so far. I'm just feeling a lot more at peace in my life, both mentally, physically and spiritually. All three now. I feel like at one point it was just physically, at one point it was just mentally, and another point it was just spiritually. But I want them all to be equally yoked, and I think that just comes with changing a lot of things in my life. And so that's what I've been doing. But um, I attribute all my success up until this point to God. Everything that I've been through, I know it has happened for a reason. I have no regrets in this life. Um, and, you know, I'm just ready for what's new. Um, I will tell you guys, always remember that no matter how far you've gone, God is always with you. Um, no matter how far gone you think you are, you can always come back. There is forgiveness for you. Um, you just have to truly want it and make a shift when you say you're going to make a change. Don't say you're going to change something to God and then turn around and indulge in the same stuff that you've been indulging and make that change. And so um, that's just what I want to do. I want to inspire. I want to instill new ideas and just spark new interests, new thoughts in your minds. Um, but yeah, just enjoy the ride, man. I appreciate all who have been watching me up until this point. We hit 105 uh, followers on Instagram. So continue to follow me on the Night Black Check just to see what I have going on. Um, I'm going to post more frequently on there than YouTube, obviously. And then also uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. But yeah, I appreciate y'all for everything. And uh, I will catch y'all in the next one as we evolve and change.